Ailing Ford, a federal judge has sided with the state of Florida in a cruise lawsuit calling the CDC's conditional sailing order unconstitutional. WPTV News Channel 5's Tanya Rogers shows you the impact it's now having in South Florida. All aboard for the first time in 15 months, cruise lines like Royal Caribbean are preparing for a simulated sailing here in South Florida. It's the first sailing that we do out of North America, which is huge. A similar story for Bahamas Paradise Cruise Line at the Port of Palm Beach. We are having a test cruise on June 25th with a select group of passengers. Uh, as per CDC guidelines. Those guidelines have been up for debate after Governor Ron DeSantis sued the CDC for its conditional sailing order. Friday, a ruling by a federal judge eliminated sailing requirements by the CDC. Judge Stephen Meriday says that the sailing order relies, quote, on state data. The ruling means the CDC also can't enforce vaccine requirements from cruises leaving from Florida. This is something that needed to happen. The preliminary injunction granted by Judge Mary Day means after July 18th, those CDC rules will become non-binding recommendations. And you can't have an agency relying on flimsy legal authority to just keep an entire industry closed with really no no path forward. This cruise line employee says she's ready to set sail. I'm vaccinated. Um, I haven't, you know, I've been very healthy. I'm very healthy, thank God. And I just need to get out and, and see my friends and see my, my work family. Tanya Rogers, WPTV News Channel 5.